Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the file not supported error in Audacity. By default, Audacity does not support file extensions like MOV and M4A and there are other extensions as well. So if you're trying to use files like this one in your Audacity, then you're going to get some error. For example, if I drag this M4A music file into my Audacity program, it says sound recording file name.m4a is an advanced audio coding file without the optional FFmpeg library. Audacity cannot open this type of file. So otherwise you will also need to convert it to supported format like WAV or AIFF. So we're just going to install the FFmpeg uh, add-on. To do that, we're going to this link. And then on this link, you can see it gives you the steps to install the FFmpeg. First thing we're going to do is go to the download link right here. Uh, all of these links will be provided in the description. So if you're following me, just go there and then go to the link from my description. Okay. So once we're in the download uh, page link, Scroll down here and then you download this file ffmpg-win-2.2.2.exe uh, You also have a program for Mac OS if you're using Macbook uh, Make sure you're downloading the ffmpg not lame Okay, so I'm going to download the ffmpg file Okay, so once you've downloaded the file, just open the installer, run it. So you can just install it to a default location or any location of your choice. We're just going to click next and then install. Okay, so once that's done, what you have to do is you have to exit Audacity and then again, open it. So for example, if you were running Audacity well, when you're installing this installer, FFmpg installer, then you have to close it and then restart it. Okay, now we're going to go back to our folder where we had the M4A files. So we can now drag this file into our Audacity program and you can see now you're able to gain access to the music file. Another thing to do would be to download the latest uh, version of Audacity. So just go to help, check for updates and then you can download the latest version. I already have 3.0.2 so if you have anything less then it's recommended that you go to the go to help in your Audacity program and then click on check updates and download the updates. Okay guys, I hope this video helped you with this uh, small issue. Until next time, see you.